Childhood dreams started early for Arkansas native Kaylee Browning. I never was an ice skater or a gymnast, but the, that's kind of where the fire came from for the Olympics. As a child, she knew the global games were a goal she wanted to get to. Oh. So she turned to what she was good at, shooting shotguns. As a young child, she was a very talented shooter. Fast forward several years, Kaylee has moved from talented to the U.S. Olympic team in Tokyo 2021. It's pretty surreal. I mean, it's something I've chased for a very long time. All right, so this is Kaylee's house. In fact, her backyard to be exact. While we've been here, we've heard cows. We've heard chickens. In fact, we've heard a donkey, but of course, plenty of gunfire, which this place is the perfect place to have target practice in the middle of a pandemic. Getting to this house slash range will take you past fields and into a gate you'll never forget. It's peaceful out here. I, sh I can shoot. My neighbors don't complain because I don't have any. <laughs> Paul. I mean, I can literally walk out my front door and train if I need to. It was 2006 when the idea to build a regulation range set in. I had a coach tell me to shoot the game that I needed to move to Colorado Springs. And I was like, OK, I'm not letting you raise my 13 year old daughter. And they said, well, you basically have to because there's no place to shoot within 10 or 11 hours of you. And I said, well, uh, I'll build one. And, and that's what we've done. The equipment cost 100,000 bucks. The hours for mowing and upkeep continue. It was my parents trying to give me every opportunity that they could so that I had the best chance to make it. This is uh, like my home office. Thanks to parental foresight that has seen a dream come true. Kaylee Browning aims at golden targets in an uncertain time. On the journey to Tokyo, I'm Aaron Nolan.